folks, welcome back to B Mills Farm. It is a Monday after work. Time for chores. Time to visit the grumpy pigs. And, uh, yeah, hopefully everyone's doing well. I got some good news. Got some good news for the channel and myself, mostly, mostly myself. Mom was trying to break out. Unbelievable. I'm not gonna talk about the good news for a second. I wanna get the pigs fed, watered, and I'll get back to you with that. It's too dark in there, unfortunately, so I'm just gonna kinda do that by myself. All right, so the brats are all fed, <coughs> and on to the good news. See that? I think that's Oh, I think that's like 20 gallons, 20 gallon size, another 20 gallon, I think, 30 gallon. Gallon. And another 55 gallon there. If this, I have lots of options now for watering and I am going to find a solution. Whether that's, I think I'm gonna put this 55 gallon, one of them in with mama and just fill it, put 55 gallons of water in it. So it's super heavy and i'll probably have to build a little platform on it and i'll put that nipple in it but she'll have plenty of water all the time and hopefully it'll be too heavy to for her to really screw with so in that 30 gallon and the 20 gallons you know i can use for future pigs or you know i could put the smaller ones into the smaller pigs for now and then I can really get a system down, hopefully. And then it will really reduce my chores every night. Because the longest part of my chores is lugging water from my house up there, back here. And I'm just doing it in five gallon pails. So I give mama 10, 10 gallons. The, uh, Missy and Hubert, 10 gallons. So there's two trips there. And then I've been giving the pigs, the small, the piglets, um, they're just getting five gallons and they're not even going through that a day because I'm also uh, soaking their feed as well. So they're getting a lot of water that way. So I'm really excited about that. Also, man, I'm really running out of daylight quick these days. Also, I am super amazed at all you guys subscribing. That's really, really awesome. I'm already, it seems like just a couple days ago, I was at 100, now I'm creeping up on 200. So I really, really appreciate you guys doing that. Um, the best way to support me is just hitting that subscribe button. And uh, yeah, so for the 100, 100 subscribers, I said I was going to start getting merch out and stuff and I'm still working on it obviously it hasn't been that long and I have some really really cool ideas that I just need to get from my head onto sweatshirts and t-shirts and hats and stuff like that so I've found a guy that uh, does the artwork and stuff so I'm gonna 
pass my ideas on to him. He can illustrate it all, and then we can get it get it going on some t-shirts, hats, and all sorts of cool stuff. So once again, uh, I really, really, really appreciate it. You guys are awesome. Um, I'm running out of daylight. You can't even see the pigs. The chicken coop's still a wreck. And uh, yeah, just a beautiful Monday in upstate New York. The snow always makes things prettier. It's not my favorite thing in the world, but everything's nice and pretty with snow on it. So I think that's gonna do it for today's video. I really don't have much more going on. I, I'm a little later because I went and picked up those barrels. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna go in and, just gonna go in with the pigs and rake out their hay a little bit so it's not all piled up because that's what they do all day. And hopefully for tomorrow's video, I'll be getting those waters figured out. So uh, yeah, you guys just keep subscribing. It's really helping me out. Like, comment, share it with somebody, hit the notification bell. And uh, yeah, just keep farming and I'll catch you next time.